So, this is the centre serving of a bowstring. What's it for and how do you do it? The centre serving of a bowstring is a tight spiral wrap of thread along the midsection of the string. The serving protects the string from abrasion and provides a snug fit for the arrow knock. So how do you serve the centre of a bowstring? First, can you tell the difference between these two servings? One was done by hand, the other one using a serving tool, like this. Can you tell the difference? No, because there isn't any. This one was done by the serving tool, this one by hand. There's no question that using a serving tool like this is quick and easy. But if you're a beginner like me and just starting out, it's perfectly possible to centre serve your bowstring using just these. Okay, so let's have a go at centre serving a bowstring. Today I'll show you how I serve strings by hand and also by using the serving tool. And I'll be serving new strings on longbows, one of which is a triple laminate longbow and the other one is a U self bow. So what do you need to serve a bowstring? Well firstly the string itself. This one is a brand new string, it's made from Dacron B. So the first thing you must do is make sure the string is fully braced and stretched before you attempt to serve it. This is the serving material itself, readily available on eBay and Amazon. You'll also need a small sharp blade or knife like this and some beeswax. For the first serving I will use this, a serving tool, and all it is is a spool holder that allows you to adjust the tension of the spool and a series of holes through which the thread is passed. And This enables the spool to unwind at an even tension. All my bows are long bows and I like a centre serving about 8 inches in length and it's centred upon the knocking point on the string. Whatever length of serving you choose, make sure there's ample room either side of the arrow knock for your fingers. The serving also protects the bowstring from wear in case it hits your arm bracer. Now the real puzzle of a centre serving for beginners is how it starts and ends because these points are virtually invisible. It's quite hard to show on camera the fine thread on the small string and how the starts and finishes are accomplished. So let me introduce you to my giant bowstring and massive serving thread. You start by laying the serving thread parallel with the bowstring. About an inch to an inch and a half will be fine. You then trap this end underneath one turn of serving thread. Make sure it's fairly tight and then continue to turn, keeping the wraps nice and tight, trapping the end of the serving thread. After about eight turns, lift out the end of the serving thread and continue to wrap. And that is how you start the beginning of a centre serving. Just cut the end of the thread and it's done. Now it's time to finish the serving. Create a loop and then resume your wrapping inside the loop. Then turn the thread around the bowstring back in the direction of the serving. When you've got about an inch of the end left over, lie this parallel again with the bowstring across the top of the serving. And now simply unwind what you've just wrapped. And in so doing you'll trap the end of the serving. And you'll end up with a loop at this end and a little end at the other. Pull gently on that end, tug it underneath and you've finished your centre serving. Clip the thread off just there. 
So that's how you start and finish a centre serving. So let's have a go at the real thing. First, this triple laminate longbow with a brand new Dacron string, and I'll use the serving tool. Once you've made a secure start to your centre serving, tension the tool and then start to spin it around the string, locating the string in the V-shaped groove at the foot of the tool. Keep the bowstring firmly pinched to avoid it twisting as you spin the serving tool around the string. Okay, this is my next string. This one's fitted to a U self bow, draws about 40 pounds at 28 inches, and I'll serve this entirely by hand. So I'll remove the spool from the serving tool. Okay, so I've marked the knocking points on this string and measured four inches either side, giving me the eight inches I require for the center serving. Here's the spool, and I'll start exactly as before, by lying the thread alongside the bowstring at the start point. Now the hard part of doing this by hand is maintaining even tension all the way along the serving and of course the difficulty of passing the spool over and round the bowstring. Okay, so we finish exactly as we form a loop. Continue to wind back round the bowstring. string. Leaves a loop and an end. And pull. And that's how I serve my bowstrings. There is no doubt about it that using a serving tool makes the job a lot easier and a lot quicker. But if you're a beginner or novice and don't have one of these tools, don't let that stop you. It is quite possible to make a really good centre serving using just your hands. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Comments, questions and suggestions below please. Thanks again and I'll see you next time.